Salute, brothers and sisters in Christ. Quick fact is it's one thing to speak a word of wisdom that's already been spoken. But it's yet another to speak a word of prophecy that has never been uttered. It is one thing to say you are a prophet. It is yet uh, altogether another thing to actually do the work in the office of a prophet not to just dream a dream or have a vision or a word of utterance or not just thus saith the Lord it is I the God of love who was and is and is to come to not just do those things, but there's more to it than words, so much more to it than words. It is a good thing to speak a word and it come to pass. It is a good, that's a great thing. But to stand against adversity <laughs> in the coolest of times, when everything is peaches and cream or a bed of roses, and to say the end is coming, the end is coming, prepare, prepare the way for the Lord. Martial law is coming. Judgment's coming. To say those things when everything is fine and dandy, it takes a lot of boldness. And that's just the word part. Then you have to have faith in it as you speak it. To know it's God. Then it has to come to pass. Then you have to keep going. It's not just stop there. There will be others. Then... You have to let your faith go in other ways. Signs and wonders and healings and miracles. Then you have to hear the people say that Jesus spoke that there would be false prophets. Not knowing that it says that there will be true prophets also. So there's much more to being a prophet than just a title. We are wasting our time if we're not in line. Holiness and righteousness. Things done in decency and in order. Moses said, let my people go. God is saying right now, get ready to go. Holy salute to the Holy Club. Keep looking up. The time is at hand.